Have you ever dreamed of doing a world cruise? This is Philip with All Aboard International, and we all know that 2020 has been a terrible year for cruises and for travel in general. But the one thing I realized is that once things do open up safely, there are going to be many people that have dreams that they're not going to want to put off any longer. As the saying goes, carpe diem, seize the day, because we don't know what's around the corner next. If you are considering a world cruise, there are many things and factors to consider. Number one, what's the length of a world cruise? Most world cruises run anywhere from three to over five months. So how long do you want to spend and how long do you have available to you? Um, if a world cruise is too long, but you do want to something, do something a little bit more special than the typical one to two week cruise, um, maybe you want to consider a grand voyage, which is in between. But the world cruises, that's, that's the time you're looking around three to five months. Number two, and probably the most important thing to consider is the itinerary. Um, all the cruise lines have, have different itineraries for their world cruises, slightly different. Um, so what are the places that you really want to go to and really want to visit on your world cruise? Maybe there's some places that you've already been to in the world that you don't want to go back to. So what are the places you don't want to go to? Uh, or maybe there's some places that you've been to and you wouldn't mind seeing again. Number three, what type of cabin are you going to want for your world cruise? Some Now you're going to be sp spending three to five months. You want to make sure your accommodations are comfortable for you. So are you, are you comfortable in an inside cabin or do you want, uh, do you have to have a balcony? Do you want something bigger? Do you, do you, do you want a suite? So there's no right or wrong. It's just about what's right for you. For um, what level of experience and what type of experience are you looking to have? Uh, are you looking for a premium experience? Are you looking for a luxury experience? What size ship are you comfortable on? Do you want, uh, you, do you, are you more comfortable on a bigger ship? Um, uh, do you prefer a smaller ship? Number five, what are the things that are important to you on a cruise? Is it dining? Is it cabin size, entertainment, enrichment programs, price? Is it a, is it a combination of all of those things? Which brings us on to number six, budget. Um, a world cruise can start from anywhere under $16,000 per person, can go right up to uh, well over $100,000 per person. Um, they're all going to, some cruises are going to include more things, some are going to include less. So you need to see what's included. And the other thing that you want to consider when you're budgeting is travel protection. If you're going to be gone for three to five months and traveling to different countries, you do want to make sure you have appropriate travel protection to protect your investment on the cruise, but also to cover you should you have any medical emergencies while you're abroad. Now, what are the cruise lines that do world cruises? There are a number of them that offer them. So in the luxury arena, we have Crystal, Regent, Silver Sea, Seaborn, um, Viking, all offer um, world cruises. In fact, Silver Sea offers two different world cruises. There's a classic world cruise and then there's an expedition world cruise. Um, uh, in the uh, uh, upper premium category, Oceania does world cruises. Um, Azamar will do a lot of grand voyages, um, but Oceania, which is really well known for their food, has a, has a world cruise. In the premium um, category, we have Princess, Holland America, and Cunard all offering world cruises. And MSC also offers a world cruise. So... A couple of the cruise lines have their 2023 itineraries out already. Um, most don't, uh, but some do. Uh, they all have their 2022 itineraries out already. And the best time to book a world cruise really is when the itineraries first come out because you're going to get your choice of cabin and the best price possible. So if you are considering a world cruise for 2022 or 2023 or beyond then, or if you have any travel related questions, Give me a call on 954-478-6392 or send me a message and I would love to help you in any way needed.